with a big win tonight versus Kansas City, and we felt like Mount Straw, you would be the man to talk to as it seems like as we get closer to the end of the season, you have found a nice little rhythm at the plate. You must be one of those guys that wants to finish strong. How's things going for you right now, man? Uh, things are good. Um, you know, we're just out here, you know, everyone's trying to finish strong on this team, you know, pitchers, hitters, and uh, we're just trying to win ball games, and, uh, you know, we're just trying to finish close to 500 as possible. You know, for you, Getting into time, I was talking to DeMarlo the other day about just where you fit in the lineup and how you came over from Houston and you were hitting a little bit in the bottom of the lineup. How much have you appreciated that they've put you at the top of the lineup and let you get comfortable there with the med usually behind you and Jose? And how does that fit your game? Yeah, I mean, with those guys behind me, I mean, for me, I feel like on base, just getting on base is huge. Um, you know, a med. You know, we all know Ahmed gets a million hits a game. Jose is Jose and Fran Mill. You know, all those guys, you know, I feel like if I get on base, you know, to lead off the game, I have a really good high or a really high chance of scoring. So um, just try to, you know, put up good at bats, you know, whether it's a hit or a walk or whatever it may be. Um, you know, just getting on for those guys is uh, is nice for them. This rhythm that you've been in over the last week seems like you've really taken advantage of hitting the ball the other way. Uh, what is the game plan that's really working for you right now in your mind? Um, honestly, that's just kind of how my old approach was back in, honestly, the minor leagues. I used to go the other way a lot, and, um, you know, it's kind of coming around. I, I, you know, I started pulling the ball a lot more this year, so um, to get that stroke back the other way is nice. You know, instead of, you know, getting under balls and flying out to right field, staying on top of the ball a little bit more and, um, you know, keeping that launch angle a little bit lower to, uh, you know, to level out the swing and put some line drives over there. There's kids and little coaches everywhere that are going crazy. You said launch angle down. I thought everybody's supposed to be going up, but it's good to hear that mm -hmm. because I think more kids need to hear that there's a lot of hits by not trying to put the ball in the air, right? Yeah, I mean, when you got four home runs, it's <laughs> uh, it's not usually a good thing when you're hitting balls at 30 degrees. So um, it's never never a bad thing to hit line drives, and uh, especially for me. I mean, that's my game, and I know that's my game, and, um, you know, it's always been my game, and, you know, I'm, I'm, I, play, I plan on sticking to it. So, I hear you. I hear um, you. You know, just getting on base and – like I said, you said it. You said it the best. Uh, those guys behind me will do the rest. No doubt. Last thing, I, you've got three games there in KC in that big old outfield. Do you know the the Indians, as an organization, have not been to that new stadium that you guys are headed to down in Texas? What are you going to tell these boys to prepare for as they go down to that new place? Um, honestly, it's a big outfield there too. It's actually it's a really fun place to play. Um, it should be a good atmosphere this weekend and. Uh, I'm excited for those guys to see it. It's a brand new ballpark, you know. It's nice facilities, and uh, you know they can pack the house there on a on a weekend. So um, it'll be a good place to finish up. Miles, keep finishing strong, man. It's been fun watching you. We appreciate what you've done. Thank you for taking the time out, and thanks for making that trip, uh, that plane ride, a little bit better tonight. Yep. Thank you, guys. You got it, Miles Straw, with a huge game tonight.